What would happen if your sensual sexual self was fully expressed and integrated into your business? What does it look like to be a sensually ignited businesswoman? What would it take to completely trust, celebrate, and cultivate your sensual sexual self? If you were never to know and experience your full pleasure potential, would this be a detriment to manifesting your dream in the world? What would you need to change in your life so that your pleasure was no longer something random or segregated? Imagine living a life where you harness your different feminine rhythms for greater success. A life where all of you shows up with renewed enthusiasm and passion whether at home, at work, or in the world. I'm Sayida Desile, and I want to wish you a juicy new year. This is the perfect time for you to revolutionize your sensual self. And I am thrilled to have a small moment with you to show you how important and essential your pleasure is to your life. In fact, what I'm about to share with you is so crucial that I hope that by the end of this short video, you fully embrace your sensual self, not only recognizing its vital importance to your well-being, but also understanding that how you express your sexuality literally shapes how you live and succeed in life. For over a decade, I've had the privilege to share with women all over the world my work and one of the things that I have found is that although we're all uniquely different, there is one common thread. How beautiful, precious, and vital our innate sensuality is. So let me ask you, would you love to feel more alive? Or have the courage to really express yourself and your voice in the world? Or have a deep, unshakable self-esteem or limitless creativity? Well, you can have all that and more. The secret, honoring, cultivating, and claiming a deep relationship with your genitals, or what I call your yoni. It has now been proven that through signals of your pelvic nerve, your yoni literally will either ignite or dampen the centers in your brain that are related to courage, self-esteem, creativity, and transcendent states of consciousness. We are literally designed through the experience of our sensual and sexual pleasure to ignite our full potential as women. Your sensuality and sexuality are not a commodity. They are a deep, essential part of your nature. So the more that you can relax fully into your sensual self, the more successful and expressed you'll be in the world. What this means is embodying your sensuality so profoundly that you literally glow. You're so turned on that you become unstoppable with your creativity in the world. So let's face it, doing business with the old model of push, push, push is literally leaving us with difficulties such as fertility issues, issues with orgasm, menopause, weight gain, and even depression. So obviously we need a new model of business, one that includes who we are at our core, our sensual selves. So here's a short and sweet routine called Ignite Delight that you can use daily to enhance your sexual health and help you access deeper and greater levels of your personal pleasure. We begin today with really shaking. Shake your hands, shake your foot, your leg, shake your other foot, other leg, shake your hips and your bum, shake your back. <laughs> if you can laugh even better, shake, 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 releasing holding patterns, freeing up your creative energy. Really go for it. Yummy, yummy, yum, yum, yum. Rubbing your hands warm, we're going to heat up the groin. So spread open your legs, push your hips forward and start to rub. Really rub your groin. <laughs> and your pubic bone, reach back. I want you to rub your sacrum really hot. Heat up your sacrum nice and warm, nice and warm. Come back to the front 
and that's what you're gonna keep doing front and back and this can really invigorate and help your pelvic health your sexual health amazing simple little practice bring one hand to your pubic bone one to your tailbone bend your knees and we'll start doing some pelvic tilts forward and back very very slowly consciously breathing notice what happens to your pelvic floor when you move this way and then we're going to start doing some little circles in one direction and imagine go right into your pelvis with your consciousness breathe life into your body it helps if you smile gently and continue breathing your breath right down into your perineum, into your pelvis. Reverse, very slowly moving your hips in the most luscious, delicious circles. Nice full breaths. <sighs> We're now going to be lying on the floor, placing our hands on our thighs, and you're going to press away. Press away and breathe deeply into your sacrum. You should feel a beautiful stretch in your sacrum as you press your upper thighs away from your hips. Just do a few deep breaths like this, enjoying that feeling of spaciousness in your sacrum. Now we'll begin very gently tapping our sacrum against the floor or the mat, just very lightly tapping. Feel the vibration moving through your pelvis and releasing any excess old energy or stress that's held here. Lengthen your legs away and bring your hands up to your heart and breasts. Just slowly start to massage your heart and your breasts, feeling the deep, profound respect of your heart. Just take a few deep breaths and bring your hands down, gently rubbing your groin, your belly, and then rest your hands over the yoni and feel as though you're protecting her. And bring that heat and that deep respect of your heart down into your yoni. Use your breath. Breathe with your pelvis. Feel the weight and the heat of your hands. Drink in that heat with your yoni. Slowly bring a hand back up to your heart. And we're going to connect our hearts with our yonis. Taking a deep breath in. And release the breath down to your yoni. You can sigh if you wish, breath in. The key is to relax deeply and to feel your heart and yoni connected. See if you can rest for a few moments like this, attuning yourself with your deep, sensual nature. Before you finish, just dedicate your day to including your sensuality. Whatever you do today, bring forward your sensual self. I hope that you've enjoyed this short video and come to realize the importance of your pleasure and some simple ways on how to cultivate that for yourself. Remember, pleasure is a daily choice. I want to thank you for being with me here today and I would love to continue to inspire you. So here's what I'd like you to do. Please click on the link below, come to my website, and sign up for my free three-part video series, The Three Myths That Are Killing Your Pleasure and What To Do About It. Be sure to leave me a comment, and we'll see you there.